Right, eh? So let's give these birds a bit of feed, check up on how they're going. Um, these chickens are making so much noise. I just fed them as well. If you want to see more about them, head up into that little icon, have a look at um, my other channel. But um, let's go check these birds out. Alrighty, how are you birds going? Maybe we'll do a little of a see what's going on here. Okay, so we definitely know that these guys are on the the right path within their coming to breeding, etc. Um, I am very confident that I should be able to leave that door open soon and they can just come out and do their own thing. I as long as the other cockbirds aren't gonna try and fight them, but we'll um We'll see, that'll probably next couple of days anyway, we can let them back out just to give them the space. They seem to be pretty comfortable with each other and I really don't think they'll be too far away from laying. Um, quite, I'm quite happy to let them out and give them more space so they're not trapped in there. They can come out all through here um, and even Storm, she can still come out for a fly. So uh, drop some comments down below if you wanna see me let Storm out for another fly. Um, hit the like button let's get this going and these two down here seem pretty comfortable a lot more comfortable than yesterday so 24 hours and they've basically had time to get to know each other and then everyone else's seems to be pretty good those two are the ones we had in the pair before in the pairing box they seem to be comfortable with each other and i would assume that because they're sticking so close to each other that they are paired or at least semi bonded with each other so We'll just leave them, see how they go. I'm not overly keen on breeding from this one just because it looks a bit strange. It's got the pointy beak. Um, it's not something that I want to breed into my barless line. So we'll just see. This first one or two generations is going to be a little bit difficult, but we're on the right track by bringing in the Leo's blood just because he's a fantastic pigeon. But um, I might just give these guys a little feed. Give these ones a feed as well. Let's see how they're all going. How's your water going? Not too bad at all. Certainly checked out this morning. Give them a little bit of a feed there. The only thing about using this white stuff is like, geez, it makes everything look a lot messier than it actually is. And I'll bring them in, give them a little bit of a feed as well see how they go i'm hoping i can open well i could probably even take these doors off soon if once i'm comfortable that these guys are 100 percent paired up which i'm pretty sure these guys are i'm not sure how these two are going down here but we'll see how they go I don't, they both are, are you know not paired up with other birds so they should pair up pretty quick Anyway, that's just a quick video. I'm gonna catch you guys later. Stay tuned for more videos. Um, there is a video coming out about my feed because I get so many questions about that. It's nothing special. It's more of a, a budget mix. So I will put that up very soon. Look at this cheeky fellas down here.